pain-related pain is common in adults and tends to get worse with age. Medications are important for pain relief, but many of them have a number of contraindications, and it is important to know which ones are best and when. The quest has been rated in this review. Traditional NSAIDs and acetaminophen have been shown to be most effective for arthritic and myofascial pain. GABA pentenoids or duloxetine for neuropathic and radicular pain, antispastic drugs for myofascial pain, and the combination of the two for pain or mixed etiology. Conventional non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs should be used with caution in diseases of the gastrointestinal tract. Gabapeptin and pregabalin may cause dizziness or difficulty walking. Ordinary people should avoid muscle relaxants as they are associated with the risk of sedation and falls but tizanidine, baclofen, and dantralen may help with spine-related pain. The older tricyclic antidepressants should be avoided due to their side effects. However, nortriptyline and desipramine can be used at lower doses. Newer antidepressants such as daloxetine have a better safety and efficacy profile for spine-related pain. Opioids are generally avoided in the artery due to the risk of morbidity and mortality and are reserved for refractory severe pain. Tramadol is well tolerated but has a risk of cognitive and opioid side effects. Corticosteroids have the least evidence for non-specific back pain. For effective pharmacotherapy of spinal pain in older patients, the lowest therapeutic doses should be used, taking into account polypharmacy, potentially reduced renal and hepatic metabolism, and comorbidities. Drug treatment should be combined with physiotherapy exercises, as well as with the treatment of the main generative process of the disease, taking into account the need for possible interventions and corrective operations. Who is armed is protected. Take care of yourself and be healthy.